right, church family, we're ready to celebrate. Ready to celebrate? All right. As Don said, that these are men and women who have responded to the voice of God. Scripture says that I call all men and women unto myself. So we're here to celebrate this, and this is Harper. Harper, how old are you, Harper? Harper is six. Harper is six. And uncle, right? Yeah. This is, this is her uncle Adam that uh, Harper asked, could Uncle Adam be a part of this? So we said yes. So Harper, you stand here today because you've made Jesus to be your Lord and Savior and you believe that God raised him from the dead? Okay. Well, then upon that profession of faith, it's gonna be our privilege to baptize you. So take a hold of your nose, take a hold of your elbow. And we baptize you, Harper, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried with Christ. Raised to walk in newness of life. Congratulations. You go out right here. Oh, sorry, I should have had you go out the other side. Sorry. All right. All right, come on in, Brian. All right. This is Lewis. It's Lewis. All right. Oh, my, John, did you hear the news? Yeah, the, 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 the heater broke. Yeah, the element that heats the baptismal yep. pool yep. is not working today. Yep. It's cold in here. So it's cold in here. We just want to manage expectations. Yeah, for the sake of the call. All right, so Lewis, how old are you? 10. You're 10, all right. And Lewis, you stand here today because you've made Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior? Yes. And you believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead? Yes. Okay, well, upon that shivering <laughs> confession, <laughs> This Lewis. is unforgettable. Yeah, yes. We baptize you, Lewis. Take a hold of your nose. Take a hold of your elbow. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ. Raised to walk yes. in the of life. Yes. Great right. job, right, buddy. Great job, man. All right. Okay. This is Vivian. I wonder if there's another step. <laughs> Step forward, Vivian. Vivian, your name is tied to a word that means life. Mm -hmm. And uh, we just pray that you experience a new life in Jesus beginning today, that today symbolizes that new life for you. Vivian, do you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord? I do. Do you believe in your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead? I do. All right, well, upon that confession of faith, we're gonna baptize you, so hold your nose and your elbow. Upon your profession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ, raised to new life. Congratulations. Yes, great job, Vivian. Yes. All right, okay, one more step. One more step. All right, we got you. Aracellus, is that right? Yeah. Beautiful name, beautiful name. Had the privilege to meet you just a few moments ago, and you've been here three weeks at Discovery Church. Well, welcome. Welcome. We're thrilled that you're here. And Aracellus, you stand here today because you have made a commitment to make Jesus Christ the Lord and Savior of your life. Amen. And you yes. believe that God raised him from the dead? Amen. Yes, he did. Upon that confession of faith, then Aracellus, it's our privilege to baptize you. Okay, take a hold of your nose. Grab your forearm there. Aracellus, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ. Raised to walk in the unison of life. Good night, Barry. God bless you, Aracellus. Hey, uh, John, did you get the memo that uh, the heating element that warms the baptismal waters is malfunctioned? Praise God. So, Praise God. I looked up in the pastor's handbook, uh, baptism water cold, and it said, tell the people it's natural water. Yeah, yeah, it's it. Non-treated. All right, well, Brindley, how old are you, Brindley? Seven. Brindley is seven, Brindley is seven. And Brindley, do you stand here today because you have made Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior? Yes. And you believe that he was raised from the dead? Okay. Well, upon that confession of faith, then, Brindley, it's our privilege to baptize you, to take a hold of your nose. There you go. And, Brindley, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ, raised to walk in newness of life. Congratulations, Brindley. All right, yeah. Okay. One step down here, bud. All right. Austin, how old are you? Eight. Eight. Austin, will you stand here today? 
because you've made Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior? Yes. yes. And you believe he was raised from the dead? Yes. Okay. Well, upon that profession of faith in Austin, it's our privilege to baptize you, okay? Take hold of your nose, go over your elbow there. In Austin, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ, raised to walk in newness of life. Congratulations. One step down right here. Well, because of a glitch, uh, Colette ended up being in the adult baptism class, and she showed us all up. <laughs> <laughs> she did. So, Colette, just uh, how do you feel about being baptized today? You said something about last night. Tell everybody what you're feeling. I couldn't sleep. Because of excitement for today? Because I was really excited to get baptized. All right. Colette, do you believe that Jesus is your Savior? I do. Do you believe that Jesus rose from the dead? I do. Okay. Take your um, hand and pinch your nose. Colette, upon, here we go. Upon your confession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ, raised to new life. Vera, how old are you? Ten. You're ten. Awesome. Awesome seeing all these kids. Well, Vera, you stand here today because you have made the decision to make Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior, and you believe that God raised him from the dead? Yes. Okay. Well, upon that profession of faith, then we're going to baptize you, okay? Take hold of your nose. Grab your forearm there. Vera, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ. Grace and new night. Great job. Great job. Now they know, John, we have a rubber ducky in yeah, the pool. Yeah, we do, <laughs> yeah. One step down here. Well, this must be our secret. Yeah. All right, go ahead, Mark. Kaysen, what an honor to be here with you today. Do you believe that Jesus is your Lord and Savior? Yes. Do you trust that Jesus and believe with your heart that Jesus rose from the dead? Yep. Well, oh man, you're ready to go. You ready for this day? Yeah. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, Kaysen, if you'll um, hold your nose and then hold your elbow. All right. Case, and upon your confession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ and raised to new life. Great job. Hi, Sophia. Hi. How are you today? Good. You're good? So, so, Sophia, you stand here today as a declaration that you've made Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior? See? Yeah. And you believe that he was raised from the dead? Yes. That's okay. Well, upon that confession of faith, then it's our privilege to baptize you. Just take hold of your nose, grab your elbow, and step forward just a little bit for me. Sophia, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ. Raised to you as the so John, we have a father and son here. Oh, awesome. One step down here. So uh, Manuel, just uh, right here come up. If you would just put your hand on your son for just a minute, we pray a special blessing on you, David, because you're serving the Lord at such a young age mm -hmm. that God will pour an extra anointing on you mm -hmm. for your life. Mm -hmm. God bless you, friend. God bless you. All right, David, I uh, love your name, which means uh, lover of God, and that's you. Do you believe that Jesus is your Savior and Lord? I do. Do you believe with all your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead? I do. Okay, upon that confession of faith, we're going to baptize you, okay? So hold your nose, hold your elbow. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ and raised to new life. Step down. One more step. Boy, what a beautiful day. You mm. being baptized with your son. What a great example, Dad. Mm. Great job. Mm. Manuel, 
Do you believe that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior? I do. Do you believe with all your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead? I do. All right, upon that confession of faith, we're gonna baptize you. If you'll hold your nose Just and your elbow. A little bit. All right, Manuel. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. You're with Christ and raised to new life. Joshua, you stand here today because you have made the decision you want to go public that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior. Yes. And you believe that God raised him from the dead? I do believe that. Amen. Yeah. Well, upon that profession of faith, then it's our privilege to baptize you. We'll take a hold of your nose, grab your forearm here, just bend your knees just a little bit. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ. Raised to walk in the house of life. God bless you, man. Be filled with the Holy Spirit. step down right here, okay? Jennifer, it's an honor to be here with you in the baptismal pool. Um, you were baptized as an infant, but now you're being baptized, what we call a believer's baptism. You've repented of your sins, right? Put your faith and trust in Jesus. Could you just say one word about why you're here today? I wanna to start a new chapter in my life, and I'm all in it with God. <laughs> So Jennifer, you confess with your mouth as you just did that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior. Yes. And you believe with all your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead. Yes. Upon that confession of faith, we baptize you. All right, so if you'll hold your nose and your elbow. Jennifer, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Bury with Christ, raised to life. And warmed up at all in here, Herman. <laughs> no. <laughs> Herman's uh, got a great story. He was in our adult baptism class. And Herman, if you could just say a word about at 46 years of age, you're getting baptized. What's happening? Um, this time, you know, to make that change and, you know, better my life and, you know, be a good role model for my kids. You're making the right, right decision. <laughs> Herman, do you confess with your mouth that Jesus Christ is your Lord? Yes. Do you believe with all your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead? I do. Upon that confession of faith, we baptize you, all right? If you'll hold your nose and your elbows. Herman, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Bury with Christ and raised to new life. God bless you, man. Caden, can you give me a big hug? Let's go for Caden. He's ready. He's ready. He just whispered, I'm ready. Yeah. We're ready to baptize you, Caden. Do you trust Jesus? Yes. Do you believe that Jesus rose from the dead? Yes. Okay, then you're able to be baptized. Are you ready? Ready. All right, here we go. Step up here. Here we go. Come on up. All right, I want you to hold your nose and your arm. There you go. Just down here. Down here. Bit. You're doing great. Caden, because you believe in Jesus, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Praise you. You did it. You did it. You did it. Great job. You did it. You did it. You did it. You did it. Thank you. 